So how does the liberal or conservative nature of a jury impact a personal injury case? Well, liberal and conservative are not just used for politics these days. Um, they're also used in jury pools. So if you have a conservative jury pool, what that generally means is that the people that are likely to be serving on a jury in a personal injury case or any case for that matter, but in a personal injury case specifically, they may be concerned with issues like protecting vital institutions and a liberal jury pool with the same case facts generally means that jurors are more concerned with moral issues involving harm and fairness. So how does this impact a personal injury case? Well, in a jurisdiction where the juries are considered to be conservative, you'll have the set of facts for a case and they'll come to a verdict and the verdict will be relatively low. Uh, compared to if you have the same case facts in front of a, ju a jury that's liberal, the liberal jury may award a much higher uh, award at the end of the case, even though the facts are no different. So the uh, nature of the jurors in a case is extremely important when valuing a case. So going back to the initial question of how does this impact uh, your personal injury case? Well, when you are trying to resolve a case with an insurance adjuster, they need to know if you're in a conservative or liberal jurisdiction. Uh, where I practice here in Southern Nevada, it's generally considered to be a liberal jurisdiction. So a uh, case here may have a higher uh, verdict than the same case in a conservative jurisdiction such as Idaho. So if you are negotiating with an insurance adjuster and you happen to be in a more liberal jurisdiction, make sure the insurance adjuster knows that because then they're gonna find out, well, hey, with this set of facts, there might be a higher verdict here than if this was in a conservative jurisdiction. And because of this, we need to put a higher value on this case.